Thank you guys for joining me today. We are doing total body signature circuit. We're gonna be doing power and toning today. So we're going to start off warming up. Um, we'll do everything for about 20 seconds in the warm up round, and then we'll go right into our circuits. Um, so yeah, everybody give me a jog in place. Start this timer. All right, and bring up the face. In four, three, two, give me some half jacks. Oh, try not to throw my phone. <laughs> And full jacks. And three, two, give me some half time butt kicks. Kicking that booty. And pick it up. Landing softly on the balls of your feet. And three, two, when your high knees, and when you're ready, pick it up. And four, three, two, jump row. Still landing softly. Shifting that weight. Four, three, two. Give me those butt kicks. Almost there. Three, two. Open those feet wide. Dynamic side lunges, pushing those hips back, weight in your heels, and make it a stretch. Keep your chest up. Breathing. And four, three, two, keep that torso centered and rotate. Give me some level changes. Bring it down and up. Down and up. Loosening up your torso. Weight still in your heels as you squat. Squeeze your glutes at the top. In three, two, one. Give me some bend and reaches. Rising up on your toes at the top. Make it a jump if you like. In a few seconds, we're gonna start doing our inchworms out to a plank. In four, three, two, here we go. Walk it down and out. Hold for a couple seconds and walk it back up. Give me three more. On your last two, add a push up in that plank. And last one. After you finish, meet me in jumping jacks. So we're going to alternate, bringing our foot up, reaching for that foot, arms wide. And in 10 seconds, we're going to go back to those jumping jacks and finish it out there. In three, two, one.
Almost there, pick up the pace. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and done. Get some water if you need it, and we'll get right into our power circuit. So keep moving, a little boxer bounce or something. Well, I'll show you what we're doing. Okay, so for most of this, we're up on our feet. Um, yeah, for the power circuit, we're up on our feet. So you can move your mat out of the way. We're gonna do a high knee pop to a squat jump. I think I'm moving my mat. So you're gonna pop that high knee up, right? You've seen people do the like walk like this. So we're gonna do one squat jump, one squat jump. So you're alternating the knee each time. Then, and also we're doing these for 30 seconds each, three rounds, okay? So you pair that with wide mountain climbers. So, actually, I lied. I thought we were up the whole time. But this is the only one. Okay, so here. So instead of your mountain climbers coming down the center, you bring your foot up to the outside of the hand on the same side. So here. All right. Then we're gonna do snap downs. So this is to prep for like when you start jumping off stuff in your training. So we're gonna start up high. So I'm on my on my toes and I'm gonna snap it down. So it's like simulating a jump and a landing. So you wanna swing, weight goes into your heels, landing, distributing that weight between both feet. Then we are doing burpees. So yeah, I don't know what I was looking at when I said we're not getting on the ground. Burpee, at first we were gonna do half, but then I said, why? So it'll be full, right? Modification, you don't have to go all the way down. You can walk it back and walk it up. Next would be a skater to a scissor shuffle. So your skater is here. We're simulating that we're skating and you're shifting your weight from one foot to the other. But the move is you'll do one skater and then scissor shuffle five times and skater again. Five, four, three, two, one, and shuffle. All right, be careful. You wanna make sure you got a good grip to make a big jump. If you're slipping, just do a little jump. And then overhead press jacks. So you've got some options here. You can literally just have no weight and do your arms. You can also have a band if you don't have weights and go here. I'm gonna use my weights, one in each hand, and I'm doing my jacks, pressing overhead with my core tight, protecting my back. So those are all six. We're gonna alternate two at a time for three rounds. I know we're like, what did we just do? I'll remind you. All right, so we're getting ready to get started. First two are gonna be our high knee pop, to our squat jump, and then down to wide, wide mountain climbers. Woo. Okay, ready? 30 seconds each, three rounds. Set, go. Up, and squat jump. Pop, squat jump. Pop. Really absorb that force in the squat jump. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one. Wide mountain climbers. Here we go. In three, two, one. Breathing. Yes, you got it. 
Halfway. Less than 10. Five, four, three, two. Bring it up. Ready? Set. Go. Ready? And squat. Yes, keep that chest up. Nice. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and down. Ready? Three, two, go. If you need to, have that pace so that way you can keep going. Make it a stretch and then pick it back up. Halfway. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, bring it up. Ready, set, go. Breathe deep. This is when them hops feel heavy. It's all right. 10 seconds. Three, two, and one. We're gonna take it back down. Ready? Four, three, two, let's go. Breathe in your nose, out your mouth. Halfway. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, woo. Station one. Done. Breathe. We're about to move to station two. We're going to remind you it is snap downs and burpees. Woo. All right. I'm going to count you in. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, let's go. 30 seconds. So we're up, snapping down. Open your toes, snap. Core tight. It's not the most exciting exercise, but it's very important. Especially if you plan to progress your power training. 10 seconds. Up, snap. Four, three, two, one. Bring this out the way. All right, burpees. Ready, set, go. Halfway. Less than 10 seconds. Four, three, two, go. All right, bring it back up. You need those snap downs and go. Let me see. Up on our toes and snap it down. Try and keep that chest up as you land. It's more about shooting that weight back in your heels, evenly distributed. Yes, yes, I see it. 10 seconds. Three, two, done. Burp. 
burpee in four, three, two, let's go. Remember, you can walk those feet back and up if you need to. I still want your chest to the ground. Almost there, five, four, three, two, done. Third round, give me those snap downs. Three, two, go. When you draw up to start that move, Make yourself tall and long. Yes. Halfway. Five, four, three, two. All right. You know what time it is. Burpees. Ready? Set, go. Keep breathing. Peel yourself off that floor like you mean it. You're more than halfway. 10 seconds. Five, four, three. Two, Woo. station two, check that box. All right, station three, we've got our skater to the scissor shuffle and then our overhead press jacks. All right, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, here we go. So skater, scissor, three, four, five. And skater, one, two, three, four, five. Skater. Almost there. And one. Let's get to that overhead press jack. Ready? Three, two, go. Core tight. Halfway. Four, three, two, done. So we're going back to the skater, but this time I want you to skater the opposite direction. All right? So you're landing on the other leg. In three, two, go. Probably the awkward side. We usually start with the good side. It's all right. Remember, five shuffles so that you end up on that other foot. Less than 10 seconds. Three, two, done. Give me those jacks. You got it. I know. I know. Ready, set, go. Woo. Ten seconds. Three, two, done. Now, 
since we have one more round, all skater, no shuffle. That makes sense. So we're just here for 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. Stretch that jump. More than halfway. Four, three, two, jacks. Overhead press jack. Yep. Here we go. Ready? Set. Third round. Ah. Halfway. Less than 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one. Ah. That was our power circuit. All right, get water, wipe your sweat. You know us, ab circuit, little baby one, before we get into toning and finisher and then falling out. Okay. We get a sip and then show you our ab circuit. Everybody good? Good, good, good. Yes, we're great, Blair. I can hear you. All right. So we are doing four ab exercises, right? Four exercises, 30 seconds each, straight through. So basically two minutes to get us in the zone for our toning circuit. First one, sprint or sit up. You can use your dumbbells for this as well. Get one. So we're gonna be here, and you're gonna come up to a running position. And you're alternating each time, coming up with power. So that's our first one. Then I'm gonna put my, I don't know, I guess we could do weights, we'll see. You're gonna have your feet up and do your full sit up to jazz. Yeah, that works. Touch overhead. Each time you come down, exhale as you jab. So that's our second one. Then we turn over. Plank jacks, 30 seconds. Here, if you need, you can step out. You can also hold it. So then we're gonna go right into plank punches. So we're gonna hold the plank and now punch. So that's more about shifting your weight without shifting your weight, right? So if you feel like you need to rock your hips, open your feet some more, and that will help you be more sturdy. All right, so that's our four. Two minutes, a minute with you. So let's get ready. Grab weights if you're gonna use them. Straight through, and four. Starting with sprinter. Three, two, Go. Sprint your sit ups. Don't rest at the bottom. If you want more of a challenge, keep those feet up. Halfway. Four. Three. Two. Next, full sit up to jabs. So touch overhead, sit it up, and jab. Exhale. Ooh, I'm putting the weights down. Ten seconds, and then we turn it over. Four, three, two. And turn it over. 
Plank jacks. Let's go. Halfway. Remember, you can walk it out. Four, three, two, okay, drop. Few seconds. Four, three, two, back in it. Give me those plank punches. Here we go. Ten seconds. Three, two, ten. Ooh, I knew going into those plank punches right after the jacks was gonna be kind of like, but e. Okay, yay! Toning circuit. All right, let's get on up so that we're not tempted to rest too much. All right. So I want you to give me a little bounce while we go over this one. I can't get this view right. All right. First is a one and a half sumo squat. So I'm still going to use my five. If you have a heavier one around, this will be the time to break it out. But I'm just going to have them here. Sumo would be your legs open wider than normal, feet turned out just slightly. And we're going to squat and do a half one, then a full. So that's the one and a half. You go down, come up halfway, then come up all the way, squeezing your glutes at the top. So now we're doing two rounds of everything, 45 seconds. So that's the first one. Then alternating reverse lunge pulses with overhead carry. So you're going to step it back for your reverse lunge but we're going to have our arms up to start. Ooh, can you come back here? Arms up to start. Then we step it back and pulse. One, two, three. And back up. The other side. One, two, three. Yes, arms up the whole time. Of course, if you need a break, bring them here and then go back when you can. So that's the second one. Then curtsy lunge with leg lift. So your curtsy lunge comes behind you like an actual curtsy. We come down, pushing through the heel. So when we come back here, that leg that was working in the lunge comes up for a lift. So curtsy and then lift. If you got a band on, great. Next is narrow squat with bicep curl. So now with the sumo, your squat was wider than normal. Narrow, your legs will be in closer than normal. You're gonna sit in your heels and bicep curl as you squat. You wanna to try to squat deep to really activate those glutes. If you don't squat very deep, it's gonna be more quad. Next, we're gonna get on the ground. So we've got fire hydrant to donkey kick and glute bridge with abduction. So for your fire hydrant, it's here. So black with head on the fire hydrant, here. Then we go from there right into donkey kick. So when I kick, my foot is flexed. So I'm not going for like pointed, I'm pushing through, kicking through my heel to really activate that glute. Then bring it back in, fire hydrant and donkey kick. So we stay all on one side, 45 seconds. Then we come back to it all on the other side. Then we flip it over, glute bridge thrust with abduction. I will put my band on. I'm just not gonna fight with it right now. So if you have your band on, you're gonna come up to your glute bridge and then you open. That's the abduction. Bring it back in, come back down. So we're going up, 
squeeze the glutes, squeeze the core, open so the band helps activate the glutes, bring it back in and come back down. 45 seconds. And we don't rest here. It's just a touch and then right back up. Okay. So we are going to start with the one and a half sumo squat and switching that with the alternating reverse lunge pulses, holding the weight overhead. So everybody get ready. 45 seconds, two rounds. Ready. Set, go. One and a half sumo squat while I fight with this camera. Okay. So we're here. Half and up. Squeeze. Weight in your heels. Still the same squat rules. Just a variation. Staying down and squeezing at the top. You're already halfway. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. We're going to switch that with our alternating reverse lunge pulses. If you like the weight is overhead, if not, right here. Ready, set, go. Three pulses and bring it up. Then switch to the other side. Three, two, one. Take your time, it's not a race. Halfway. Fifteen seconds. Focus on that form, pushing through your heel. Five, four, three, two, done. All right, back to the sumo. And remember, we're just doing two rounds this time. Ready, set, go. Beautiful form. More than halfway. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Yeah. Back to those lunges. And four, three, two, go. Core tight. Squeezing your glutes at the top. Fifteen seconds. I see y'all. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! All right. We are moving on to station two. What was that? Okay. Curtsy lunge with leg lift and the narrow squat with bicep curls. Okay. I have forgot y'all. Ready? Set? Go. Yes. 
So the front leg in the lunge is your working leg that is also the lifting leg. You're more than halfway. Ten seconds. Three, two, done. All right. Now the narrow squat with bicep curls. Yes. In four, three, two, go. So we want to see how deep we can really get in this squat. More than halfway. Ten seconds. Four, three, two, one. Percy lunge on the other side with leg lifts. And four. Three, two, go. Woo. Breathe through it. More than halfway. Core is still tight. Ten seconds. And done. I missed the countdown, my bad, you guys. Done, done. Narrow squat to bicep curl. Nose up. Grab your weights. Four. Three, two, let's go. Yes, nice control on the down. I noticed I was starting to swing like this. I started paying attention and I see you guys are controlling it. Great job. Fifteen seconds. Three, two, done. All right, we got to take it down to the mat for the station. If you got a band, you want to put it on. All right, we got about eight seconds before we get into it. All right, so I got mine around my thighs, and we're going to start with our fire hydrant to donkey kick. I'm going to put my towel right under me just when I start dripping. Ready, set, go. All on one leg is your fire hydrant to the donkey kick. Remember, push through your heel so your toe is not pointed. It is flexed and you are kicking someone in the face with your heel. Halfway. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three, two, 
Then, oh. All right, we're gonna turn it over for our glute bridge thrust with abduction. So remember at the top, you open your legs or your thighs. Ready, set, go. So up, squeezing your glutes, open. And touch, but don't rest. Then come back up, open. You're halfway. Your hips are reaching for the ceiling. You stay at the top, open your thighs, then bring it back down. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, done. So we're gonna turn it back over and do our fire hygiene and donkey kick on the other leg and then come back to our glute thrust. Ready, set, good. So opposite leg, 45 seconds. Let's do this. Pressing through your heel. Halfway. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Let's turn it back over to our glute bridge hip thrust. Don't forget the abduction at the top. Ready, set, go. 45 seconds. Your hips are reaching for the ceiling. Your core is tight. Your glutes are tight. And it is burning. Ah, more than halfway. You've got 15 seconds. Three, two, one. That was our Tony circuit. Whoa. Okay. So get some water, wipe your sweat. Of course, we're gonna do a finisher. So what I'm thinking, yeah, okay. Yeah, I put it down. So I'm gonna show you what we're doing. We'll all get water, cause I'm thirsty. And then we'll just do it. All right, so we're gonna do three things for 45 seconds each with like a couple seconds in between just to transition and kind of catch up breath, but not, you know, really like all the way recover. So the first thing will be interim tricep pushups. Um, I think I can leave my view like that for now. So we're gonna stay low for this one. So you're gonna come out for your inchworm, but your hands are close together so you can do a tricep push-up and then come back to start and then go right back out, tricep push-up. So we're gonna do that for 45 seconds. Then we're going to do a bear crawl. So we'll start in our bear and we'll crawl about eight paces, pop it out to a plank, Pop it back into a bear and go backwards. Same thing, about eight paces, pop it out to a plank, pop it back into a bear. We'll do that for 45 seconds and then we'll bring it up to squat jumps. We'll do like three and then hold for three seconds at the bottom 
and then go right back into three squat jumps, hold for three seconds at the bottom, 45 seconds, and then afterwards we'll all just fall out. Okay. So get ready, wipe your sweat. Got about eight seconds. I'm gonna drink something real quick. We're gonna be in it. All right, and four, three, two, and short triceps. Go. Walking it up. You just want to do as many as you can, but with a good form. So we're not rushing. Make sure you hit those triceps in your push up. Don't rush it. Already halfway. Five, four, three, two. Shake it out. Get ready for your bear. In four, three, two. We're going to do about eight paces. Pop it out to your plank. Back into your bear. And take it back. Let me see those bears. You can do it. You're more than halfway. All right, bring it up to that squat. We're gonna do our squat jumps. So we're doing three, and then hold at the bottom for three. Three jumps, hold at the bottom for three. Ready, set, go. Halfway. Ten seconds. All right, give me one more. Hold it. Three, two, one. Oh. Okay. <laughs> that was good. We beasted. Okay. Let's cool down and stretch, you guys. Man. Excuse me, but I don't even want these shoes on. I'm stretching. I'm just saying. All right. Shoulders. Woo. And roll the other way. Take your head around. And the other way. Lock your fingers, chin to your chest. Open those shoulder blades. Stand it up and lean back. Now, lock them behind you, chin up. Hinge at your hips with a flat back, lifting your arms. All 
All right, stand it up. One arm across, uh, shoulder down, away from your ear. Other side. Tricep stretch. And other side. All right, come on down. Drop one shoulder, look over the other. Other side. Center, sink it down and roll it up. Nice and slow, one vertebrae at a time. Bring those feet in. One foot behind you. Same arm up and reach. Other side, one foot behind, same arm up and reach. Shake it out, just give me a deep breath. And exhale. All right. Yeah.